and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. Today, we got the brand new Easter eggs hatching and a bunch of new players, actually. So, some of these eggs are containing Color Smash players that are like 97 overall, guys. And so far, they're super, super cool. I got a sneak peek at a few real quick as they were just coming out. I won't say anything. We're going to get into this. We're going to open up my eggs first and we're going to check out the block. But, guys, they, they might have hit on this one. I don't know yet. The eggs were super hard to pull. Weren't exactly the easiest things to pull, but I saw some pretty big name players on the block already. Stuff came out pretty early for some reason, but we do have a few eggs for us to open on the channel here. So let's open up some eggs and then check out what else we got. So let's start with some small eggs. Small egg legends. I wonder what it could be. It says legends, but I don't know exactly how it's going to. Oh, okay. Legend pulls. If it's if it's 80 plus, I'm fine with that, honestly. But if it's just, if it's like below 84, that kind of does suck. But if I see a big X, that'd be pretty cool. Oh, big X right there. 86 Anthony Mooner, so it's just like an 80 plus legend pack. That's really not horrible at all. That's not bad in the slightest. All right, so next one we got a small one, Reggie White. Let's get to the next one. I wonder. My big one's an Ultimate Legend, so I'm kind of excited to see if that's gonna be a full Ultimate Legend. And we get 86 Rice. I'm excited to see if that's gonna be a full Ultimate Legend, or if that's just going to be like a random 90 plus, which kind of suck. Go to the small egg theme builders. Probably 80 plus as well because they are tiny eggs. All right, so there we get. 85 Anthony Austin Seabrook. You know how many times I pulled Austin Seabrook, guys? He's like one of the few cards that I consistently pull. And next, I don't know what the big animation looks like, so just bear with me. 85 Nathan Gary. Pretty sure that's about the worst they can get. All right, we have a medium egg theme builder. So this one actually could be a little bit better, probably close to 90. That, that's a big one. 88 Antoine Randall L. Okay, that's not bad. Next, we got open next egg. I think it's Super Bowl egg. So Super Bowl animation, real quick. I never liked this animation. 88 JR Sweezy. And that leaves us left with our Grand Egg Ultimate Legend, guys. So my my opinion, I think this will probably be an Ultimate Legend. I'm hoping a full Ultimate Legend, but it could be like the other ones. But guys, before we get into the rest of this video, make sure you're down below. Hit that subscribe button. Turn the notification bell, boys. Come join the family. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, as always. And if you're new to the channel or whatever, smash that like button, guys. Comment down below if you, got, if you guys need anything. And let me know down below what eggs did you guys pull. Did you guys get the new players? Did you guys get something really cool? Those Grand Eggs? Let me know what you guys down below. Don't forget to subscribe, by the way. But let's go check out this grand egg. Let's click into it. I'm hoping it's a full ultimate legend. That'd be super cool right now. Full ultimate legend, big X, and we get 96. Howie Long got Will Ferrell. Ah, uh, that's the worst one, right? I'm pretty sure Howie Long is the worst one. Oh, guys, the market is probably taking a bit of a hit right about now, just because of the fact that all these eggs are opening. Uh, Howie Long, really? I would have started a lot of these ultimate legends. We get Howie Long. For like 80k, he's, he's 60, he's 62k. Is the market dead? Is it happening? How long is 62,000, 62,000 coins for 35,000 training? You guys understand the level of training that you're getting right there? I need, I need to go check this out my own eyes. Is the market done for? Oh boy, I think it's happening. That was super, super cheap. I mean, I guess you have to really, they must be crashing so bad you have to actually filter them out to even notice what's going on because there's so many. How about the full ones? These don't look horrible yet, but let, let's obviously filter these out first and let's check. Left us a linebacker. Okay, these aren't dying just yet, but guys, let's check out the block in general. Let's see some of the new players. Go over some of the stats. There was quite a few different players that I was seeing. So let's go over to Color Smash and then we're gonna go over to 97s, I believe they were. And let's start checking out some of the stats and going over these cards. Now, this could be pretty much the end for this promo. I don't think there's going to be a part two. This might be, like, the pinnacle of it on. It's Easter Day, so I think that's, that's kind of it. But don't worry. We still got some more stuff coming. We got golden ticket drops on Thursday. We supposedly should have an NFL draft at some point. But let's go on down and slowly find some of the new players. So, let's see. Let's see. They are 97s. Starting over, Derek Henry was one of them. That was, that was kind of surprising. People have been wanting a Derek Henry for a long time. Now, they did do it, boys. They gave him a 93 speed, so they did hurt him a little bit, but you can power him up. So, if you power him up and you put Sprinter on him and you put John Madden's speed on him, you get him to a 97, which is still not that fast considering what we can get about this time. But he's 93 Excel, which again isn't great. 89 agility, not great. 99 carrying is amazing. 65 catching, not great. 84 elusiveness, not great. 95 truck, 94 break tackles, honestly good, but it's not great either. I don't know what it is with Derek Henry cards. I'm not going to get it right. He's a little bit faster than that in real life. Compare him to Saquon Barkley, that's just per se. Saquon's way faster, way better excel, way better agility, one less carrying, which on my team gets the 99 carrying, way better catching, way better looseness, less trucking, way better break tackle, 
Alvin Kamara is the same speed. Better excel, better agility, better catching, better loosening the same break tackle. 96 Barry Sanders blows this card away. Not a fan of this Derrick Henry card. Does he have like a 99 stiff arm at least or something? Good strength. Okay, he has 90 strength, but 90 strength is huge. Because as you guys know, in my opinion, I think strength just plays a big part in tackle breaking and like how ferocious you run. But let's see what else he's got. He's got a 98. Okay, so he does get a 99 stiff arm powered up. So that's at least, that's pretty good. He'll have a pretty crazy and nasty looking arm bar for the most part. But we got plenty more cards, uh, a decent amount more cards. So let's go check these out as well. Next, let's see what's on the list here. I don't want to rush through them and give them all away. Uh, let's see, let's see. We got Khalil Mack, which I was pretty excited about. Mack Attack is back in the game. He has not gotten a lot of upgrades this year. At least, you know, like his timing just never works out. Like when you want him, he just does not come out. But six foot three, 89 speed, 90 excel, 90 strength, 91 tackle, 97 play rec, 94 block shedding, 96 power move, and 92 finesse move. The issue with Mack for me this year has been that I have Lawrence Taylor, who I think is better. But this Mac is super good. You guys run if you double pass rush from both outside linebacker spots. Mac's your guy. Mac, guys, quite honestly, Mac is pre pretty solid. 89 speed. He powered up and kept up. Gonna get to a 99 overall. Just about, I'm pretty sure, on most teams. He'll have close to like 97 block shed. He'll have 99 power move, 99 play rec, 92 speed. This card's looking pretty solid. We gotta also check out the zone. Now, he's not gonna have a zone, but if it's at least, if they ever give him in the 70s, I'll be excited. Zone coverage, 57. Didn't think so. There are formations where you could use him and Lawrence, like a uh, big nickel, or like a three, four odd, where you do some kind of, where you, where you uh, blitz both outside linebackers. If you put the odd guy, like, other guy on it, obviously in a typical three, four, only one of them's rushing, but you can make both rushes certain information. So it really depends how you play. Maybe like a five, two, but in my opinion, I only like having one for the most part rushing. So for me, I'm not going to go that route compared to Von Miller, obviously blows him away. And as I go on down, I can't really compare him to much else, but I think he's I think he's solid. I still think Lawrence Taylor is a bit better, just because Lawrence Taylor is gonna get another new card pretty soon that's gonna blow away this one. He's gonna have like 99 finesse power, 99 block shade, like close to like 95 speed. The next one's gonna be pretty legit for the most part. And I believe there are two more cards. Let's go down a little bit. Maybe they were lower end cards. Because I did believe I saw him. Here we go. Adrian Amos was one of them, and T.Y. Hilton are the last two. Let's go over Adrian Amos real quick. 93 speed, 92 excel. For a 94 overall card, not bad. He's got 78 tackle, 95 play rec, 90 pursuit, 82 man. Holy, okay, I'm gonna go down. He's got 92 zone, 88 hit power. Honestly, this card's so well rounded. I always love that about Age and Amos cards. His card's just so well rounded. Guys, you power him up, chem him up. You can get him to a 97 speed with John Madden and Sprinter. 97 speed with lockdown and everything. You can get him up to like a 96 zone. You can get him to about a 90 hit power, 99 play rec. Guys, this card is honestly super, super solid. This is a budget piece if I've ever seen one. He will be making the next budget piece list. You compare it to anyone else, like you went to Troy Polamalu, his power, his hit power won't be too far behind, his zone won't be too far behind, his man's very similar, his speed won't be too far behind, and he's a difference of three overalls. I'm telling you guys, this Adrian Amos is super, super solid in my opinion. I think he's a great card. I've always, like an older man's Adrian Amos was always great for that too. He always just has a great speed and a great hit. He always has great speed, a pretty good hit power, and a great zone with a pretty uh, redeeming man, which is impressive too, I think, for man, because I blitz a decent amount. So when you blitz and you don't have man on safeties, I'm telling you guys, it's a bloodbath. Like if people just send their running back on the route or they, they man up on the tight end, the tight end does just one little out route, you instantly get destroyed. You need that man card. Even then it's still kind of hard. It's hard to do, but it's definitely beneficial. Next, we got T.Y. Hilton, 94 wide receiver for the Indianapolis Colts. 5'10", 93 speed, 86 jumping, 91 catching, 84 catch in traffic, 87 spec catch, 93 route running, 91 medium route running, 92 deep route running. Card's decent overall. Catching's not great. I, I personally think there's a lot of other players to get. Not a bad budget piece, though, because he's going to be super cheap. But, guys, real quick to go over some of the other eggs that I have been seeing over on Twitter. Guys, there's a pretty decent amount of eggs. So, there's going to be a there's team of the weeks. There's going to be, obviously, Ultimate Legends Legends. I heard that the biggest egg was Pat Mahomes, which is one of the blue eggs. Pat Mahomes, I'm pretty sure the Barry Sanders and the Master. I saw Lamar Jackson was one of the eggs. Grand Egg Lamar Jackson. Now, I don't know which one that is. That could be. That was the pink on top, purple on the bottom. That one could be uh, the Redux one. That one could be MVP one. Or that could just be his Blitz one. I'm really not entirely sure. I see that we got a Nick Bosa, Zero Chum Nick Bosa, a Color Smash, a Grand Color Smash egg, which is probably one of the top players. Marshall Lattimore, Zero Chill uh, JJ Watt. Guys, there's so many players from different promos. Hop on, open your eggs, guys. Enjoy the rewards. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you're into the channel, make sure you go down below. Hit that subscribe button. Turn that on, boys. Come join the family. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, as always. 
And if you haven't already, make sure down below. Comment what you guys get from your eggs. I want to see what all you guys are getting because it's pretty interesting to see what everyone's pulling. But that's about it for the video. Thanks so much for watching. I'm out. Peace.